All right, our fourth level, Meridian Station, is a little bit of a unique. It's one of those uh, walk, you know, look and explore kind of levels. So let's uh, take it all in one take, which is kind of nice, I think. Anyway, first piece of intel is right over here, right before you enter the camp. I'll get the guys who spend all day worrying about Governor Sloan. You can't deny, he does a hell of a job. I sure he does that thing where he talks with two voices sometimes, but most folk do the same thing. Just aren't courteous enough to do it out loud. It doesn't bother me. I, mean, I know he's got Meridian's best interests at heart. Our second piece of intel is right up there, as you can see. Oh, hold on. Not close enough, I suppose. Oh, you'll see when I get up there. So, it's up on that little outcropping there. So you just hop your way up. If the damn game will let me. Okay, let's see. There it is. Okay. Now you can you can actually see it now. You just come up here on this brown tarp area, and it is right here. We should talk to the people of this station. One of them might have seen signs of blue team. The high winds, the plasma kicks up. Scatters things for miles. Stuff can get thrown into the molten soil. And if it doesn't burn up, it... It sticks like a fly in amber. Or things get caught in bubbles of ash, like inside a snow globe. And sometimes things just happen, like finding one single house untouched in a glass field. Figure that's just to help us remember. Make us remember. Really kind of more... kind of gets you down. <laughs> Alright, next piece of intel is going to be over here. Right by where there is a fire, because be fire. fire is being there you go. We haven't limited to the non-essential supplies. We have non-essential supplies. Up on a station, everything's white and gray and bland. Some folk are afraid of any place the corners aren't round. Wouldn't dream of living down here, where the ground is ash and glass. Good riddance. A few years time, kids who come up on Meridian are gonna run this system. Bet your life. Alright, uh, fourth piece of intel is by this uh, area <laughs> you come towards the you come at towards the end of the level, but you can see it's it's also right next to this vending machine, which if you click it enough times, a soccer ball will appear. But anyway, it is right over here. The plasma they use to glass plants burns so hot most stuff just vaporizes. But sometimes there's a flicker in the beam and the temp drops just enough. And that's how you get stuff that's still intact. And yeah, sometimes you get bodies. It's ugly, but I didn't get hung up about it. What gets me, though, is the dogs. Just excavated a homestead and there was a leash leading under the porch. So I'm taking a day off. So coming from there, we actually had a couple pieces of intel in this little alley area, I guess. So the first one is right here. Cleared deep the other day. Cut through what used to be a forest. Dug through the glass and cracked right into a natural cave formation. Found actual plant life and pools of standing water with little white bugs hopping around in them. After working sterile glass for so long, seeing those bugs done me a world of good. And then if you look up, uh, hold on, there you go, see it's right up there, so, just gotta figure a way up. Gotta wonder if it's even possible to resettle this mess. There's sense to the plan, chip off the glass, hope the soil below is still viable. Hey, Spartan, my friend here has some strange ideas about the... And, right... <sighs> here Meridian didn't get it too bad they hit the human settlement hard sure and the plasma bombardment boiled some of the oceans off but there was enough atmosphere to hold some steam in Covey's did a rush job and the planet survived less than a third is Le Chatelet right so we chip away at the worst parts like cutting a rod off an apple quick job should be done inside of 20 years 
And the last piece will be right on this building, right across from here. Or, sorry, not the last piece, the seventh piece. Ah. <laughs> but here it is. I found a body in the glass today. Shook me up. <clears throat> Doc Kale said I should talk about it, so here. I'm talking about it. Think I'm done now. And the very last piece is over by the pelican, where you t that you take at the very end of the level. It's right over here. Running a top level D glass south of the populated area, and we hit some kind of metal we couldn't cut through. Ran a pulse, and we got echoes of a subterranean structure or something. I don't know, I'm not on the anthro team. The thing is, there's loose soil beneath it. So whatever that metal is, it shrugged off a direct plasma bombardment. Damnedest thing. So what does that sound like? 